Good morning, Tigers. We're coming to you live from the Tiger Vision Studio. Today is Friday, November 10th. I'm Caleb Blotterback. It's game day. one of playoffs and we're going to be going up against Terrell High School. Yeah, I think we're going to do good this year. Now for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Texas pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one indivisible. Please pause for a moment of silence. Now it's time for our segment trivia today. Today's question is, which U.S. president was the first to pardon a turkey? Question coming at the end of the show. I have no idea. I actually have no idea. I didn't even know that that was a thing. Me either. Attention seniors applying to or interested in Stephen F. Austin State University. Our SFA recruiter will be here on Monday, November 13th to meet with you and assist with application questions, housing, scholarship, and financial aid information. We highly recommend that any senior applying to SFA attend this meeting on Monday, November 13th during enrichment in the upstairs math and science collaborative space. Our SAU recruiter will be here on Tuesday, November 14th to meet with you and assist with application questions, housing, scholarship, and financial aid information. We highly recommend that any senior applying to SAU attend this meeting on Tuesday, November 14th during enrichment in the Upstairs Math and Science Collaborative Space. Attention juniors, the free school day ACT offered by the State of Texas will be given on Tuesday, March 26th. Juniors must sign up through the post in your class of 2025 classroom to take advantage of this opportunity. The last day to sign up will be Friday, November 17th. See Ms. Fuller or Ms. Stark in the College and Career Readiness Center if you have any questions. We want to congratulate Gabby Lancaster for signing with Arkansas State University. You know, Gabby's just got a bright face about her. Everything she does is just, she's got a smile on her face. She's a tremendous leader for our softball team and has uh, got a big senior year ahead of her. So coaching has always been a big part of why I've kept going because Coach Slider actually helped me. Like, I was ready to quit. And Coach Slider was one of the main reasons I didn't because she's always, like, been somebody to push me even though I don't want to keep going. Uh, I've coached her for the last three years and we have had mem many memories over these years. Um, she's an incredibly hard worker. I mean that just shows her being able to play at the next level. Um, she's serious all the time, you know, but she can she can be jokeful, you know, and have fun. That's what I do love about her, like I said. I love how she's on the field, she's smiling, she knows when to be serious, but she's always smiling. You know she loves the game and she's having fun doing what she does. I know she's worked really hard, so this is a great opportunity for her. Right. I do know Arkansas State is a D1 school. It takes a lot of work to get to that level. Attention students that are interested in current events, U.S. history, and winning some cash prizes of up to $5,000. The State Citizen B Competition is a statewide clinic education program and competition for students in grades 9 through 12. It's a spelling bee focused on the current events, the Constitution, and U.S. history. For more information, go to citizenbee.org or see Mr. Barrios in room 13 no later than December 1st. Hey, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. 2023, the Newsboys are back to let the music speak. Hey, what's up? This is Michael Tate with the Newsboys. Join us for a little bit of rock and a little bit of worship. Let the music speak with Newsboys. We will be performing an all new show with brand new songs you'll want to sing along to. So come check it out. Newsboys are coming to your city in 2023. Visit newsboys.com for all the details. I am so excited. They are coming to our pack, and if you've ever seen the Newsboys, you know that they can put on a show. It's really insane. Yeah, I was a big fan of them when I was a kid, so it's really exciting. Attention juniors, applications are available for the Royal Royalty with Youth Leadership Camp. 
The camp will be February 23rd through February 25th and there is no cost to attend. This is open to current juniors that show leadership potential and good character. Please see Ms. Fuller and Ms. Stark in the College and Career Center to get any, an application. Applications are due no later than November 16th. Students, scan the QR codes on the ASVAB flyers around campus. Students must register by November 14th to be able to take the test on November 16th. You must take the ASVAB test to qualify for entrance into all military branches. For more information, contact Administrator Ms. Jones or Mr. McIntosh in room 114. In case you missed it, today's trivia question was the first president to pardon a turkey. And the answer is Harriet Truman. In 1947, Truman presented a presidential pardon to a turkey for the first time. I had no idea who it was going to be. Me either. I don't know who that is. Now it's time to wish our Tigers a happy birthday. Happy birthday to Marley Watson, Tristan Ellis, and Angel Garcia Olade. Have a great day, guys. That's all we have for today, Tigers. I'm Caleb Waterback. And I'm Karis Coleman. Have a great day, guys. We'll leave you with football highlights.